Guys, 2010 trailer. As you can see, this uh, coolant reservoir it had a uh, crack on the hose connector right here. So we need to replace. Anyway, uh, in order to replace this reservoir, we have to remove the air filter and the air hose here. As you can see, the air hose are connect to the throttle body. And we have the temperature sensor right here. As you can see, the harness a little long. I don't need to disconnect this. It'll pop something right here. Uh, Disconnect the hose here, remove everything, and one more thing uh, important the base hose in, in the bottom of the reservoir. We have to use the, the right grip something uh, to pin on the hose to avoid the cooling. When we remove the reservoir, the cooling it came out. So now we have to change the glove and uh, I already have the cat container put into the car for I uh, cast all the coolant drip out and uh, anyway it, we don't have room for here you get a little screwdriver yeah just loose around loose around Yep. Okay, guys. It pop out a little bit. And anyway, okay, I have the new one. That's it guys, uh, if you have uh, the same problem with your vehicle, then follow step by step in this video and uh, change this by yourself and uh, save a lot of money. Okay that's it guys, uh, thanks for watching, see you guys next time, bye bye.